wa hudumu wa afya sasa itashirikiana uh, na asasi za kupiga msasa hospitali ili kuboresha utendakazi wa hospitali humu nchini vilevile mamlaka hiyo imesema kuwa itazindua mfumo wa kuwawezesha wagonjwa kuwasilisha malalamishi kuhusu wa hudumu wa afya entire system strong and organized if you don't have supplies and you don't have uh, bottles to take blood specimens and you don't have blood available for people going to surgery the next day are making the whole system very weak. I don't think the answer lies in one particular organization like ours. It is a multi-sectoral, multi-faceted, multidisciplinary approach in strengthening the health system. We need to make sure KEMSA is functioning like a well-oiled machine where you buy and you have supplies available. We need to make sure that the doctor's postings and all the health professions are posted in the right place at the right time. We need to ensure that the health financing systems are also functioning appropriately. We need to ensure that the Treasury and the Ministry of Health are in tandem to get their funding on the right time. We need to make sure the counties are responsible for the primary. The point I'm making is to answer your question, it's a little complex, but we need a systematic and an efficient approach, which is what the Ministry of Health is always trying to do to ensure everything functions well. Our, our view is I fully agree with the professionals. If it's very frustrating at your place of work, and you cannot treat patients because of lack of supplies, or you cannot treat patients because of the lack of diagnosis, you will not be able to provide quality. And you might find yourself thinking, did I choose the right profession? And our role is to enable integration of the existing regulatory bodies and have a more collaborative environment a more harmonious environment for patients to be proud of in the quality that they give, but also they should have a conducive environment in which they should be proud to continue being a health professional in Kenya.